I'm Amy Hendel. In this video, we're exploring the smoothie as a useful tool in weight loss. If you make smoothies that are low calorie and nutrient rich, they can be a healthy alternative to meals on the run. Just be mindful that liquid calories do add up quickly, but they can also deliver a terrific, nutritious, bang for your time and energy buck when you're trying to lose weight. So for this smoothie, you'll need skim milk, a banana, some soft tofu, vanilla yogurt, blueberries and strawberries, and some ice cubes or crushed ice. When making smoothies in a weight loss program, be sure to carefully measure ingredients. Don't throw in any additional tidbits because you need to be calorie conscious. And those extra calories really add up quickly and excess calories equal weight gain. Also beware of most commercial smoothies. Many of them are loaded with calories and lots of processed ingredients. Be sure to check the calorie count. The wrong one can be as much as a large bowl of pasta. So let's get started with the ingredients. We're gonna put in the skim milk. And we're also going to use fat-free yogurt, and that's to help keep calories down and to avoid saturated fat. Both are good ideas if you're trying to shed pounds healthfully. Also remember that liquid calories are not quite as filling as calories that come from whole foods, so when you do add high fiber foods like bananas and berries to smoothies, that can make them more filling. And bananas, they're also rich in potassium and support healthy blood pressure. Now, I love tofu, but plain tofu often puts people off. It's a great food to hide in smoothies because it's chock full of protein and it also offers a variety of healthful benefits. And in fact, the protein from tofu and yogurt in this recipe is really gonna help make you feel full and it's gonna build strong muscles. And frankly, when you're satiated, you're less likely to reach for less healthy snack foods. I also love strawberries, and what I love about strawberries are they're really low in calories. They're also rich in vitamin C, and that may have anti-inflammatory properties that help to protect against chronic diseases like heart disease. Now blueberries, this is an interesting one because they're really purple, and it's another great food with amazing health benefits. They're loaded with fiber, they're also very high in antioxidants, and that may help to slow aging and prevent cancer. Now look, it would be great if all your food was organic, but that can get a little expensive, so if you're on a budget, at least consider buying organic strawberries and blueberries. They're part of the Dirty Dozen. That's a list of the top 12 foods with the highest pesticide residue. When it comes to fruits like oranges, we typically don't eat the peel, so buying organic is not quite as critical because the pesticides used in farming are mostly concentrated in the peel of fruits and vegetables. But if you're thinking about using orange zest, then you want to use organic. Here we go with the blend and let's give it a little time because we need all those ingredients to mix up. I know that losing weight can be oh so challenging. So a smoothie like this can offer good taste and a calorie conscious, nutritious meal option. So here's to your health. 